Hey everyone, it's Dewey. How are you guys doing? I'm doing great. Uh, if you guys have been paying attention to our channel or the PC modding community recently, you know that this mod for Arma 2 Combined Operations has been blowing up. The mod is DayZ. And there's a lot of people out there who are confused, they don't really know what to do. Uh, and I'm just kind of making this video real quick to show you guys some really basic things on how to uh, help yourself in the game. If you are a veteran to the game, if you know exactly what you're doing, I would stop watching this video now because it's not going to help you any. Uh, this isn't any master's guide. But for all of you guys who are just jumping into the Arma game uh, for the first time really, I want to show you guys how you can kind of... Uh, help yourself and help do things a little bit easier um, When I first got in I got attacked by a bunch of zombies. I didn't know what I was doing my screen started going black and white It started getting blurry. I didn't know how to bandage myself I didn't know how to fix myself um, And the really easy way to do that is sometimes you guys can scroll wheel But the surefire way to do it is if you press a button G that'll open up your inventory um, You have a bunch of different things here uh, The inventory is a little bit confusing um, but for now, we're not going to explain it. We're just going to really tell you what to do. Um, these things down here are called your, uh, are, are the bandages. Uh, in order to use them, you just need to simply right click them and then left click bandage myself. Let's say you're, you're, you need to eat, you're uh, a little hungry or you need to drink some water. Um, the, it, it's, it works the exact same way. You just need to right click eat food. Um, my water is not filled right now, so I just need to fill that up. Uh, but if you had a full water, it'd be the sim it'd be similar to that. Um, so if your guy's screen, let's say your screen is really, really blurry and you don't know how to fix it, um, what that means is that your blood is too low. Over here on the right where the debug monitor is, you see the different numbers here and you see where your blood is at. You want it, I think, to be the good numbers probably around 12,000. Uh, if it's below 5,000, that's when your screen's gonna, excuse me, that's when your screen's gonna start turning black and white getting a little bit blurry um, and I believe if it goes below 2000 is when you pass out um, and that's not good don't want that to happen uh, so in order to increase this there's a couple ways you can do it you can either eat food which will give you back some blood uh, if you uh, ha kill a deer I believe people were saying uh, if you kill a deer or something like that or a cow cook that food uh, that'll give you like 800 blood back um, I think these little ones, they don't do very much for you here. Um, I'll eat this here and see what it does for me. You also, See, it only gave me like 200 blood back. Um, basically, so you need to do that. Or if you have a partner with you and you're near a hospital, you can buy some blood packs and then, uh, not buy, but you can find some blood packs and do a blood transfusion. Uh, that's a little bit more complicated. I'll show you guys that uh, once I get into that situation because uh, I know that that can be really confusing. Um, it's a military simulator, so it's not, it doesn't work like Call of Duty. It doesn't work like Battlefield. Uh, everything is a lot more, I guess, realistic. Um, you know, I, I, I say realistic uh, with a hint. It's, it's probably is, is the most realistic you'll get with a video game uh, at the moment. It is you, you are permanently dead. So you want to make sure that you learn these things to take the morphine, painkillers, bandage, and when to do those at the best times. Because if you don't, then you'll die, and that's not good. Um, you're permanently dead. You need to start completely over. Uh, so that's really quick. Uh, show you guys how to do those things. Uh, if you like the video, remember to leave a like or a uh, or a subscription for more Arma 2 DayZ content. I'm having a lot of fun with the mod. If you guys want to come play with us, um, look for the live streams. I'm live streaming every once in a while uh, with the game, so that would be awesome. Uh, leave that like if you did it. Uh, if you guys have any uh, questions or anything like that, leave that in the comments so I know to try to answer them and find the answers for you guys. I'm no expert by any means for Arma 2, um, but I'm trying to make those people who are, who are new to it, similar to me, make their lives a little bit easier when coming into the game. So thank you guys, and with that, we'll catch you guys on the flip side.